hi guys welcome back to my channel and for those of you who are new here welcome my name is Yannick and welcome to the Yann's diary oh so in this video I'm gonna go on the road I'm gonna take you guys to Port of Spain particularly on Arapita Avenue so we're gonna go and get some gyros food you know any of the food may have reach so without further ado let's get going what part of the avenue you want? I'm by the gyro stand. Welcome to the city of Trinidad and Tobago. Guys, this is Port of Spain. And we are heading to Wrightson Road to then branch off on the avenue. You guys are wowed by the architecture design of the buildings. Some of them are skyscrapers. Next place that I want to take you guys to is the Radisson. They have an amazing restaurant. It's called the 360 Restaurant. It's actually at the top of the building and the restaurant itself rotates. And they have the food in our buffet style. So the area, the restaurant itself rotates and also the buffet section is around in a circle basically. So you just go around the, the different tables and you select the, the food choices that you want and also they have dessert as well guys it's amazing so here's the top of the building here yeah, that's the 360 restaurant we're on the avenue so the Jaros section is just a block away and you'll see how the setup is so we're here on both sides of the street you could see the different restaurants and it's always amazing to see you'll see well several of the same food types along one street and yet there's no tension there it's kind of strange seeing that and the other thing is that even though it's the same food they're selling they each will have the long lines of customers waiting just to get their the different gyros so yeah that's good if you're not a gyro lover like me, you could always choose to get chicken with fries or you could get um, wings with uh, mashed potato, anything that you desire, they have different sides, so you just choose. Oh, they also have burgers as well. Purple. Slide purple.
yeah the weather in trinidad is so weird at this minute it will be bright and sunny and the next minute it's raining heavily so i've gotten what i wanted so i'm gonna head back home now before the rain starts to fall even heavier the section is called independent square so as you can see um, there's a lot of food places along the strip you can see kfc Ooh. on that side you have kosha bank royal bank now we're at the transportation center. Oh, these pigeons are definitely tamed. I could walk right up to them and they're not running enough. Look here, look at this. <laughs> it's amazing to see them. All right, let me see if I could get a closer view of the pigeon. Yeah, that's a closer view of me. <laughs> now let's look at the pigeon. Look there. Go close my get to him and him not fly away. I guess them accustomed to persons walking about. So them team now. Guys, so this is my gyro that went all the way in for the spin. Just the one llama and shrimp gyro. So I don't think we are allowed to eat on the roadside so that's why i brought mine home so this is how it looks yummy 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 so how they prepare the gyro is that they have it on a long skewer and they place it vertically and they do it in a rotisserie method so you have an option of either chicken beef lamb and you could also mix it with some shrimp the word gyros um, is said to have originated from Greece. So I don't know what it, what it means. But <laughs> oh, that's a lamb meat. Well cooked. Moist. It's not dry. So usually, if I were to have it on the roadside, I would have kept it wrapped up and then just peeled on one side like this mm -hmm. mm. yummy 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 usually i wouldn't go with the shadow benny sauce but today i opted for all the different sauces that they have available so this is like fully loaded and there you can see the shrimp you can see mm -hmm. so this is lamb and shrimp gyro thumbs up So, also you have two options you could either wrap the gyro the meat itself in a wrap or you could put it stuff it inside a pita bread so that's that's the two options that you have really good mm. Taste of the shrimp. Really good. So guys, pretend that I'm on the roadside eating. <laughs> yeah, that's the next thing. It's very messy. <laughs> if you're not careful. So if you guys are in Port of Spain, so you know that Caribbean Airlines is um, slowly allowing flights all over now. If you guys are in Trinidad and want to have a great taste of street food, 
would suggest that you go on the avenue, Arapita Avenue that is, and go to Asan's Jaro. They have the best taste in Jaro. I kid you not. From me, so, so that means it tastes good. They have real foodie. <laughs> and this was only for $50, 50 dollars that equivalent to about $7 US. So not bad and it's a large gyro for those of you who are new to the channel kindly click the subscribe button and don't forget to leave a like and also drop a comment in the section below tell me which street food you prefer at the area tell me which street food i could try okay <laughs> bye, -bye guys